What's going on everybody? Yao here. Thank you for joining me. In this episode, we're going to do some physical workouts. Mentally, I'm worked out. I'm ready to go. A lot of you know I got a movie starting next month. Well, you're probably watching this in August, so this month I got a movie starting this month. Mentally, I'm fit. I haven't directed in two years since 2018. I got some ring rust, but I'm going to dust it off. They want to know if I'm ready. I will show you. Trust me, I'm ready. I am ready for this film. It's called The Cure Game. But physically, I'm not there yet. Since COVID-19 hit, I gained some uh, COVID pounds. Can't really grab it, but it's not that bad. But it's there. I gained some COVID pounds, and I want to get rid of it. Maybe like five pounds or something like that. I want to throw off of me just to be in shape and ready to go for the cure game and be on set. Any any craft you're in, any field you're in, you want to be physically fit. Um, you just perform better. Period. Anybody will tell you you perform much better if you're physically fit. So, like I said, mentally I'm ready. Physically, I want to get ready. So I got my boy. I gave a quick phone call to one of the best that does it to get me in shape. His name is Chevy. You'll see his information below once we call him in and everything like that. But let's jump straight into the episode. No further ado, let me show you a little bit of what Chevy does, man. Let's go. Feasy Production. Chevy here called the best to do he's gonna help me get physically fit but he also does mental and I'm gonna let him explain what he does exactly so everybody meet Chevy man how you doing guys my name is Chevy so um just want to give you a quick breakdown of what I do um, I work on running mechanics speed and agility also gait cycle I also work with a lot of athletes so anywhere between the ages of 9 and 15 years old or between like 20 25 or even grown-ups you know anyone that needs pain management or you know lower back pain or knee pain I help manage people to you know do Certain exercises to help, you know, restructure their posture. Mm -hmm. So um, today we're gonna take Ria yeah, through a couple of yeah. exercises. Today I'm gonna break down some running mechanics. You know, teach him some core stability, strength, show him some basics. So whenever he wants to get out there and uh, do some agility work or some speed work or just a, a light jog in general, you know, yep. he'll have the foundations and the fundamentals to carry him through. Exactly. And Chevy, tell us where we can find you if these people want to get some personal training done, get in shape on Long Island. So if you can find me at Apex Fitness or KK Athletics, or if you want to, you can also follow me on Instagram and you can shoot me a DM. Um, and we can take it on from there. Excellent. I mean, you'll see his information below. His name probably popped up his Instagram. So DM him. I'll leave also his website and all the information he just said in the description box. Let's head over here and see what Chevy got. And one more. Today. Oh, throw it one in. more thing. I'm sorry. Yep. One more thing uh -huh. too. Also, you can find me on Mind Body too as well. Oh yeah. You can type it in Apex Fitness and you can check out all the group classes. Uh, mm -hmm. Sign up and then do your thing. Do your thing, man. I'm telling you, he's good, brother. You can see he's in shape. It's not no joke. I'm about to get in shape. I gotta lose this man before the next movie. Chevy's gonna help me do it. Let's work, baby. Let's, Let's see what work. Got Let's work. Here. Come on, D. All right, so the only reason why I always take the shoes off is because I like people to utilize the muscles underneath their foot. Oh, yes, okay. Yes, because the shoes have support. So okay. when you can actually feel your ground okay. and you can ground yourself, yeah. it makes it makes things a little bit easier for you and wow. it'll carry up the body, it'll carry up the chain a little bit better. All right. All right, so Ooh. first thing we're going to do is high knees. Okay. All right, we're going to start with one in each box. Uh, you can lead with your left foot first, so it's going to go just like so. And the eye will carry you right through. Okay. It's one in each. Yes, sir. Yeah. We're going to run that back one more time. All right. So little keys that I'm looking for are some cues. Uh, high knees and then opposite arm, opposite leg. So okay. if the right arm comes up, left leg comes up. If the left leg comes up, I'm sorry, the right arm comes up. Okay. Here, here. So we'll run that back one more time. So nice and simple. We're going to drive the elbows, pump the knees high as you can, you and maintain keeping the toes up to the ceiling i'm gonna break down some stuff for you i got right, you right, Chevy, i gotta get back right. here, i got you i got you now we're gonna do two in each so it's the same concept we're gonna do two in each box so now we can lead either with the right or the left i normally lead with my left first so here one two one two one two one two one two one two dang all right all right, all right. yes sir yes sir yes sir yes sir yes sir Damn, that show is crazy, <laughs> bro. 
Now we're gonna switch the opposite foot now. So since we led with the left, clap, clap. Stepped up in the game like rock. Right. Ball boy with the hook can't stop. Can't stop. Let the dread on my head stay locked. Look, yeah. always no island. No island. Stay fly, no pilot. no pilot. All beef, no diet. Yeah. Real G, stay yeah. silent. Right. I'm all for the mission to pray for the tension because the yeah. best of us come with complacency issues. And then the chosen and high cause replacing, no picking the tissues. Yeah. They're thinking and crying and laughing and ain't for the mission. I've been up like yeah. all night. Good caps, too. For real? Yes, sir. You got a good body, man. You got a good build, good base. Yeah, I just you know gotta keep saying? up, man. I'm That's it. Candy, That's right? it. That's it. That's it. Chase my legal name to pop. Y'all a bunch of birds. I ain't even got a fly. Looking for the beat, find a light up in the trap. See it at the top. Praise be the child. I ain't need a job. Glory be the guy. Millie with the rock. Jordan with the hops. Catch me at the growth. 10 30 on the road. bro. Let's do it. Chubby, tell them why you said no uh, shoes. No shoes because. Tell them. because the muscles underneath your foot, they need to be worked out. So the support of the shoes inhibits that. Oh. So the more you practice without. without the shoes, the more you'll be able to ground yourself. Yes, sir. That's the warm up for today. <laughs> Damn, you put the shoes back on. Burning, bro. <laughs> nice and stable. You see Bruce Lee? Yeah. How you got these cuts and yeah, the kicks and all that? Yeah. Yes, sir. That's where that deep, deep, deep core, in, deep core strength comes into play. Okay. So I'm gonna teach you how to hold how a to plank by engaging that. And most people want to do a plank, they do it regular. So I'll show you real quick. Most people they do a plank and they let their belly flop. They either go this way or they're like this. Or what they normally do they let their body flop right so really quickly this is what we're gonna do you're gonna pull in the lower abs super super important the way your body works your body thinks it's one complete muscle so from head to toe you are connected there's nothing in your body that moves independent they all work together so in order for you to activate your true true deep core muscles you're gonna pull in your abs lower abs as much as you can you in the plank I'm gonna take this stick I'm gonna put it directly on your back. Your job is to make sure the stick's completely straight and your entire spine is leveled. So from here, you're gonna pull in, I'll show you really quickly. You may shake a little bit for the first time. You're gonna pull in nice and light, and then we're gonna stand in this position. Head's gonna be down just a little, and all I want you to do is tuck your tailbone underneath you and pull in the core as much as possible. And we're gonna hold this position here. If you do this correctly, you should only feel this here. Not over here, a little bit in here, but more so in the lower abs. Okay? So let's give a shot really quickly. Move forward just a little. There we go. Shift a little, right there. Now, all I want you to do, mm -hmm. this stick is gonna be on your back. I just want you to tuck your chin in. Perfect. Now, this section of your back, I just want you to lift up here. There we go, right? Now, take the lower abs and I want you to pull it in as much as you can. Okay? And then from here, I just want you to come off the ground, straighten out the knees just a little, as trying to maintain this in here. We're gonna hold this for 10. Mm -hmm. Nine, eight, seven, six, tuck the chin a little, five, up a little more, there we go. Three, two, one, and relax. Wow. Perfect. So it's going to be really tough to try and hold and maintain that, but your job is to just try to focus on pulling in your lower abs as much as possible. Okay. And then what I mean by tilting your pelvis underneath you, oh, yeah. put it this way, right? This is called a anterior pelvic tilt. When you have an arch in the lower back, this is called a posterior pelvic tilt when you tuck the tailbone under. Okay. When you tuck the tailbone under, you get more hamstrings, more glutes engaged, and you get more TVA engaged. Okay. If we let it loose like this, we rely on our lower back a lot. And that's why a lot of people in today's day have lower back stress because they don't have proper TVA functioning or either weak glutes yeah. or weak hammies. Wow. So all you need to do as you're in the plank from here, tuck just a little. Dog, this guy is no joke, man. Uh, but if he, everything he says right. Like he said, you're not gonna feel it in your shoulders. I didn't really feel it in my shoulders. Usually when you do planks, you do feel them in the shoulders. Feel it all here is burning and then, yeah. So, I mean, you went to school for this? Yes, sir. He knows a lot, man. Very <laughs> educated, posterior, anterior, pelvic tilt. School and, like, and self-taught. You know, this always, guy is no joke. You know, I always upgrade and you know look for information, new information, because life is changing every single day. So we can't carry on life with the same information yep. we learned back years ago. You know, we Stagnant, have to keep. Yeah. We have to keep adapting. We have to keep progressing. Mm -hmm. 
All right, and so uh, yeah. I told you I called the best, man. Obviously, this is no joke, dude. It's hot in the sun, but we're working, man. You got to work if you want to achieve. So nobody's going to come to your door with success. You got to get it. So let's work. Big drop top and I'm rolling. And I told my girl I'm going to be up till the morning. Feeling like I'm two, three, because you know I'm zoning. Shawty got a way. We've been chilling by the ocean. Now I got a big drop top and I'm rolling. And I told my girl I'm going to be up till the morning. Can I say, ooh, I got them looking at me sideways I can't take no days off, they know I can't Lately I've been in a different mind state And I got them tripping, I've been making hits I don't got no time for misses Shawty wanna ring, yeah, she tryna be a missus I've been so ahead, I don't think y'all really get it They been taking L's, they can't see how I've been winning And I got a drip, so they see me making breakdown what would you? What is a whole? Um, how do you say it? Like a course, a full course meal for you, and throughout the day, what would you have for breakfast? Okay, like, for, for example, this morning I had egg, scrambled eggs. I put, um, I'm sorry, scallions. I put onions. I put peppers. I put garlic, a little bit of paprika, mm. and Himalayan salt. Okay. Scrambled it a little bit. I made some bacon. Mm. All right. I oh, made some bacon. Pork. Okay. I made some bacon, <laughs> some and then I had some avocado on the side. And you made Just that avocado. yourself, you cook? This myself. Hey, that I cook learn every single day, I cook every single day. Really? So that was my breakfast this morning. And okay. then for lunch, I had salmon, baked salmon, and then I had rice, and I had a little bit of peppers and onions on top, and I had another slice of avocado again. This so guy. that was my meal for today. Okay, and for lunch, what, I'm sorry, for dinner, what is something that you are planning to have? Dinner? Or, or last night, whatever. That's right. Okay, so dinner, it, it, it all depends. You know, I try to keep it light. Okay. Uh, later on in the afternoon, I also do intermediate fasting too. Intermediate fasting, chef. Intermediate fasting. Me. So I wouldn't eat anything like past nine, ten o'clock. Oh. You know, okay. Like later on in the afternoon, I want to eat around like five, six. You know, eat a nice little meal. It all depends. Sometimes, um, sometimes I'll eat fruit. Uh, sometimes I eat another meal again. It all depends. Okay. It's not really specific. And then I won't, I won't eat anything past nine o'clock or ten o'clock. So I can go to sleep where I'm not sleeping and everything's digesting and I wake up the next morning either feeling bloated or, or tired. So between that window of right. like nine and the next morning when I wake up, sometimes 12 o'clock or one o'clock is when I have my first meal and I eat, not eat, I'm sorry, I drink water. One o'clock so in the afternoon, the next day? Yeah. yeah, but you have to you have to plan it out, you know? Oh, it's not, so you don't jump into it. Like yeah, you, you plan it out. So okay. if I want to do like intermediate fasting for a couple of days, I will do that. If I feel like I'm feeling a little bloated, a little bit heavy, or a little yeah. groggy, you know, I'll like cut off the eating. The reason why I cut the eating off is I want to give my body the chance to digest everything else that I had previously. Oh. And then bring it, you know, then incorporate, you know, other food and stuff like that. See, the problem is a lot of you guys watch all because this is not the first video you see somebody talk about their diet. It's not the first video and or the last. You're going to see someone working out with each other or whatever. If you notice, the common trend is the same exact thing. Work out, eat healthy. Work out, eat healthy. And make sure your mental is healthy as well. But that's a whole other thing. But work out, eat healthy. There's tons of videos out there. And if it's still not working for you and been watching tons of these videos, the problem is you doing something wrong or not being disciplined enough. So Chevy's saying the same thing a lot of people say years ago. People are going to say years to come. You just have to take action and do it. Take action and do it. And again, this is all based off my experience. Exactly. exactly. I'm not saying this is going to work for, for you. you. Yep. I'm not saying I'm a doctor. Mm -hmm. This is stuff that I just explored. This is information I found online. I applied it yep. through myself and it worked out for me. So, you know, you can try, go do the research. There's plenty of research. Exactly. Google is big, saying. YouTube, you know, mm -hmm. do the research and experiment on your own, mm -hmm. you know, and just figure out what works for you. But you're going to have to eat it. You can't just work out either. Don't think just work. You got to eat healthy, man. And like Chevy posted something on Instagram about that. I saw it. Yeah, he's right. We can only help you so much. You got to be able to do something too. You can't work out and eat McDonald's and all that stuff too. Or constantly. I mean, once in a blue is fine. I mean, Chevy, you call yes, it. Bye, sir. You can't do a Monday through Sunday and then work on expect you're going to get a body like that, man. So it's all grind. But that being said, let's jump into these workouts, baby. Let's get it, back. Baby. All experience, baby. All experience. All experience. You know? So, Chevy, what's your ultimate goal? Like, what's your ultimate? Own a gym, own a couple gyms. Yes, yeah, so own a gym, actually. Seriously? My Brother goal. wants to own a gym, man. Goal, Put it in the man. air. It's gonna happen. That's my goal. It's gonna happen. Gym, like multiple space. Planet Fitness is that kind of thing, right? Like no, franchise. No, 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 or... no, no, no. My field of work is gonna be different. Okay. You know, I like taking my own path. Okay. You know, everyone goes this way. I'm going that way. Ah. I'm that type of person. Like a personal trainer thing? Yeah, more so of like uh, I want more of a community. Okay. I want a community where like this client knows this person, this person knows this person. So let's say you come into the gym. I know y'all. Y'all know. Bob, 
you know what I'm saying? Oh, you know? tighten this. So tighten brother's this. trying to open a cult. Feel him choking. Making waves, they don't even see how many chances I done gave. I've been working hard, dog. I think I need a raise. Said I couldn't do it, but I told my girl to pipe down. Need it right now. Lately, I've been going to the lights out. Got my face up and my eyes down. Shorty, now you know what this is like now. Now I got a big drop top and I'm rolling. And I told my girl I'ma be up till the morning. Feeling like I'm two, three, cause you know I'm zoning. Nice drive, baby. Nice drive, 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 drive. Here we go, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Nice drive, baby. Okay. Okay. Yo, the shoes are the shirt. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Let's go, baby. working with something here. I'm telling you, brother. They got no more in the tank, man. Let's, Let's go, though, baby. Let's get one more. These shoes, bro, they're killer. I got you, too. Chevy status. Let's go. You see them. No shoes, baby. Oh, all the way through. All the way through. Chevy, can you go through? Yes, sir. I got you. Follow him, beat Ronald. Got you. That's it, baby. So that was today's workout. That was a really, really nice today workout. Oh my God, Jesus. Again, I just wanted to say thank you for the opportunity. You know, thank you again for, you know, being open, allowing me to explain mm -hmm. different things to you. Thank you again for being here. I really, really, truly appreciate you guys to the fullest. I also admire you. Super, 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 super really admire you. Thank very you, inspirational bro. to see you doing your thing, man. Um, from 2017, Yes, Yeah, Sheldon, tell you. 2017. This man said, I'm going to create my own film. I want my own product. A couple of years later, he's living now. Yes. Actions. You know speak what I'm saying? Louder than words. Actions speak louder than words, baby. That's enough. Cut the camera. <laughs> I know I got a big job, top and I'm rolling. And I told my girl.